Hey, what's going on dudes? It's Mitch, or Beijing Canadian here with episode 44 of Pixelmon, and I just want to say that last episode I may have got anti-power moved, but this one starts with a big stinking power move. Ah! Oh, it's awesome. And you dudes know that I don't like to uh, abuse the power movement. I don't like to take advantage of it like Jerome does and say it way too many times, but I just couldn't believe it this episode started on such a high note. And you're really going to love it. So of course if you do, slap that like button which for it means a lot to have your support. And of course, I will see you all tomorrow with the next episode. Let's go for 20,000 likes. I think we can do that one easily, dudes. And I'll see you tomorrow. Take care. Yeah. Jerome, you're never going to believe this. Although you already TP'd here between episodes and saw it. Mitch, I, it's too easy. I know. And, and here's the thing. I swear on my grandmother's, my, my, own, my own life. I swear on all my YouTube monies and everything. I did not spawn these in out of You don't rage. need to swear, because you can read the chat right there for, from the last episode of this one. No commands. Oh, true. I can just hit T. Yeah, oh. T. We literally wow. just one recording to the other. Not a single, single thing right there. This is as legit as it comes. I, I, this, like, this is the Pokemon Center I was just at, too. Literally, as we stopped recording, I turn a corner and I go, Jerome, everything's going to be well, okay. Well, this makes up. For us not getting those thunderstones last episode. And that other Eevee. Wow. I found two Eevees in one spot for us. That is something special. Now, when I get internal server error here, find this Eevee for me. Don't let it go on. Got it, buddy. I guarantee it. Okay. That was just too much right there, man. Okay. I'm burning this Eevee just a little bit. He needs to roast. Wow. Wow, does that ever feel good. Now, if this thing burns to death, that won't feel so good. Come back here. I'm not done with you. Bitch, I already caught mine. You better get yours, too. I'm not done with you, Eevee. And there's a bubble sword. I need that. I need that. I need that. Oh, this is just paradise. Oh, my. This is actually ridiculous. Wow, there's a bubble sword right over here. I Level need to catch 12? it. That one's mine. That one's mine. Sure. Hypnosis. I hate you. What are you? You're going to catch it. Oh. Stop running, Eevee. You're going to die. Oh, that was close. Definitely not gonna just catch it. Okay. Wow. All right. Let Mitch. me. Can I at least put it in my Pokedex first? Evie, stay in. Stay in what? Your balls? My balls. You want him to stay in your balls, bitch? I do very much. Man, this is ridiculous. How did you find this spot? Like we're just this going around. This like... is what I call. The reverse anti. It just makes up for the anti mini. Dude, this is amazing. This is literally everything we could have Can asked. Could you have waited one more? S you jerk. I hope it breaks out. Yes. Now I got Bulbasaur in my Pokedex. You could catch it now. I don't even care. Wait, why? You already have a Bulbasaur? I have an Ivysaur. Yeah, but you have a Bulbasaur in your, in your thing? Yeah, I just right clicked it with my Pokedex. You can murderize it now. Oh. Or you can catch it for trading purposes. Well, why not have the worst Pokemon in the game? You know, exactly, right? Why not? I still think Bulbasaur is the worst Pokemon in the game. I just hate nah, him. He's the coolest starter, but he's the worst. Wow, a cool starter? Yeah, you wish. <laughs> let, me, let me check my, my watch real quick. Yeah, everybody. I mean, you can't see the watch, but it's... uh, Yeah, the smudge, the little smudge off there. There's a quarter pass. Wow, not... not No. That's what it is, Mitch. <laughs> it is a quarter pass, which is not true. False. It's okay. I feel pretty good. Now I can rub it in Maddie's face. Two Eevees, not just one. Jerome! Yes? You know if we get a couple more uh, Eevees and all the Thunder Shards, we could have an evolving ceremony. Oh my god. And just get every form of evolved Eevee besides Umbreon and Espeon at once. We could do this. But Mitch, do you have any Pokeballs left? Uh, I'm running out of Pokeballs. I have 12 Ultras on me. Mitch, I'm running out of Pokeballs. Am I supposed to care? Do you want to catch the Bulbasaur? Oh, you're, you're really trying to get him? Why wouldn't I? Because he's, he's a, a Jag starter. and we don't need it. He is a Jag, but he's a collateral kind of Jag. You know? <laughs> if you need me, I'll, I'll teleport back. I mean, Bulbasaur, any starter Pokemon are always good for trading. I guess. Wow, this Bulbasaur is actually going to kill my purple booty. Mitch. I, <laughs> I told you, Bulbasaur is the hardest to catch. The Ivysaur, all I did was throw like two Ultras at it. 
That Bulbasaur, I literally wasted 15 to 20 of them, and then I gave it's up. ridiculous. I'm about to whip out the Master Ball. <laughs> Do it. You don't have what it takes. You won't. Wow, Bulbasaur. I've wasted all that. All right, you know what? Hey, Bulbasaur. Knock, knock. Oh, who's there, Drome? Hyper Beam! <laughs> That's who. Wow, look at that one right there, boys. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> That's a door he shouldn't have opened up. <laughs> but he did. <laughs> He's dead. There's no taking that one back. <laughs> knock, sorry, knock. I'm not sorry. Who's yeah, there? Knock. Who's there? So Hyper P. <laughs> sorry, I'm not sorry. Wow, look at that. <laughs> Can't believe it happened like that on camera, too. Oh, that was great. That was great. Oh, this is a baby graveler. I'm gonna try cat. I'm gonna just throw one ball at it, see if I get it. Why not? You should. He's so small. Hey, two raw fish. Nice. It's a sign. Thank you. Thank I'll, you. I'll, those guys. I'll, I'll, I'll toast that one. So go. Oh, some more raw fish. Wow. I'll have you insist. Jerome, I just want you to know yeah. that I threw one Ultra Ball at a level 31 Graveler without damaging it at all and just walked away and I caught it. That was pretty dope then. Yeah, that, see, Bulbasaurs just have a problem. Well, that one has a, a serious problem now. <laughs> it's got Hyper Beam straight to the face. <laughs> <laughs> That's a pretty bad problem to have. If I bring him to the doctors. What well, seems to be wrong? Oh, it appears, appears you came down with an nasty case of hyper beam to the face syndrome. <laughs> Joe, have <laughs> like you ever seen person. a wild Gyarados? Because I am looking at one right now. Are you serious? Yeah. Does it exist? It's huge. Let me see real quick. I'm not joking. I gotta see this one. I've never even heard of that. What the heck? And he was he was swimming above the water a second ago. Wait a minute. Do you mind if I fight it? Like, what level is he? I don't know. I wanna I wanna battle it. Oh, you can battle Sure, let me see. Come on, oh, I want to catch it. It's fine. Yeah. level 25. No, no, he's fine. Finders keepers, but what level is he? 25 only. What the butt? I did not know Gyarados is good. Uh... I have a feeling I'm going to one-shot him, so I'm going to do it anyways. No, you should use Dragon Rage always on a Pokemon that you're going to one-shot. Because Dragon Rage always hits 40 damage. Come on, oh. don't murder it. Yes, red health. Perfect. Well, I found an underwater mob spawner. It's way underneath there because, you know, I uh, my map didn't generate, but... Hey, there's a camera up. Be good training for my flygon. I think I just captured this Gyarados. A wild level 25 Gyarados. Oh, what, he bit me, really? Gosh. Well, do you already have a Gyarados? No, or? I have a Magikarp. I never evolved it. Oh. Yeah. That's so, convenient for so you, this, then. Yeah, it's, it just makes my life a little easier. That way I can be like, I really do collect them all. I still have Magikarp and a Gyarados. Well, speaking of an easier life. Oh, God, the mud kept on. Guess who just leveled his flygon to 50. Oh, that's you, that's you. Lederhosen man. Lederhosen man. This Gyarados has the lowest possible health he could get, and he keeps getting out of these balls. I only have like eight left. Oh, that's pretty bad. But it's worth it because he's Gary the Gyarados. Or is he Betty? Nah. This well, is, I already this had is Betty the Gyarados. I call him Gary sometimes though. But is your is your Gyarados is he a male or a female? Yeah, it's male and the same Betty. <laughs> is there a problem? <laughs> no, not at all. Uh, I'm just making sure, because, I mean, it's a pretty manly name. My axe is always named Betty. Oh, that is a girl, so I guess it's not really, no, you know. The axe is a beautiful thing to behold. Seriously. Oh, yeah, the axe, yeah. Why do you think I named her Betty? She's beautiful. Is she not? Like She's a goddess, actually. Yeah, Betty the Diamond Axe. Come on, Gary. Yay, he stayed in. I got him. I got him. And Gyarados was a beautiful uh, thing as well, so. It's only fitting, really. Really, it is. Oh, wow. Two Rhydons over there and a Machoke. That's some good stuff. Oh, good for me. Bad for them. <laughs> Is it going to be a hyper beam straight to the face? No, no. Flygon's already level 50. So, I mean... Plus, that's just plain rude. Probably going to be more like a flamethrower to the face. <laughs> okay. At least it'll warm them up before they die. Oh, yeah. That's reasonable. That's respectable. I, I can I can respect that, for real. They don't, they don't deserve a knock-knock. They're really not being aggravating, but... Man, that Bulbasaur... <laughs> <laughs> Bulbasaur is actually one of the hardest to catch. I don't understand it. Oh, man, you don't have to understand it, because R.I.P.M. Rest in power moves, Bulbasaur. <laughs> really? <laughs> that last one. You don't have to understand it now. I solved that one for you, which I solved the great mystery there. <laughs> I love 46 Charizard, thank you. Excellent. I oh, there's another ride. Close. I just started running away from me. That was pretty funny. Wait, what is this thing? Oh, I thought it was holding something. Vulpix, Poliwag, Poliwag. Did I catch Poliwag? I think I did. I think I just need to get Polyrath, which is a Water Stone. Which I can do, because we got Water Shards. 
Woo, that's right. I might do that. You say water sards? Water sards. Sards. What's a water sard? Yeah, I really don't know. Oh, well, it sounds pretty cool. Yeah, I'd like a water dope. sard. It's pretty dope. Yeah, I'd like a water sard if that's possible. <laughs> yeah, one, one, I would like a, a one water sard, please. Yes. Yeah, level 50, but wow. champ. This is a great area to train, dude. I had two machokes already and two ride-ons, and now two more ride-ons just spawned in next door. I'm just biting this guy's Pokemon right now, trainer. I'm getting no XP, but whoops. Yeah, I'm getting plenty of XP from this. This is a great training. Oh, Mach Machokes are great. They're like always level 35 plus, and they give you 1,000 XP at least. Yeah, and Rhydons are always at least level 30, and they're always a, a good time. There we go. All right. Did he give me something? Dang. I wish I wish battling trainers oh my could God. get rewards like random stone shards or full stones and things. That'd be cool. I did it, Mitch. What'd you do? I just... <laughs> what did you do? I couldn't help myself. My Charizard are a new flamethrower, and he gave me the chance to learn flamethrower again. I'm like, well, there's nothing wrong with having two of a good thing, so now he's <laughs> now goes flamethrower twice. Oh, gosh. I guess they never passed that one. That's fine. Yeah, um, I guess giving me one of those flamethrower TMs wouldn't have been, you know, too... I think I might learn it already, so never mind. <laughs> Yay, level 50 pimp. All my Pixelmon and my party are level 50 plus. Hey, Jerome, we heard you like flamethrower, so there's another flamethrower. Well, if I have to, boys. <laughs> Probably my favorite move of all time, so I'll take two of them. No, no, don't push it. Wait, what? Really? Flamethrower? Oh, isn't it? Oh, flame wheel. Sorry, jeez. Flame wheel? What? You don't like flame wheel? Fire bless, more like it. That's Runescape. Come on. Are you serious right now? Yeah, fire blast is Runescape spell. Y yeah. Fire blast, Mitch. Can I help you? Yeah, I really hope you're kidding. Can I help you? Your comment section. Hey, have you reached? I'm just, I'm just telling. Not I'm caring. Just, yeah, I'm just you telling have. you right now. Your comment section, Mitch. Leave a message. It's just going to be absolutely spammed. I feel. I feel really sorry. Spammed. It's gonna be absolutely beautiful. People talking about RuneScape and Pokemon, the two greatest games from my childhood. Please. No, it's there. I just feel bad for you, man. I'm what? sorry. Nothing, man. Nothing. I just wow. Wow, some people, man, they just don't have feelings. That's you. No. That's you. It's gonna be really bad, man. <laughs> what? I, I, I just, I'm just cringing, thinking about what your comment section is gonna be like after that one. What? Fire, uh, fire blast. blast? Is it a RuneScape move? Yes. Did I ever say? Why not even be? Did, it, might, it may be Flame Blast in RuneScape. Did I ever say it's not a Pokemon move? No, I didn't say that. All I said is it's a RuneScape move. I'm gonna, you know what? I can't. Even oh, is that shiny or is that a boss? That's a boss. Oh, dang! I thought I found a shiny Diglett for a second. Didn't mean to alarm you. That's okay. You know, shiny whatever. Let me oh shoot. wow, wow! I think I might have to. Bag Sorry, my viewers, because I'm going on Google Chrome right now. Let me see about this one. Let's Google uh, Fire Blast Runescape. I think you're right. It could, yeah, it is in Runescape. But Mitch. But what? Fire Blast. Pokemon. Sure, I'm, I'm about to bag and tag a level 85 Diglett. I just want you to know. Wait, for real? <laughs> that is Did actually I just catch false. that? In one, I just captured a level 85 Diglett in one ball. Are you serious? You didn't even, like, damage it? <laughs> I used my level 50 Blastoise and hit it once, and then I just caught it. And you just died. I just got a level 85 Diglett. Wow. That's powerful. Good job. Thank you. Stats on that one, boys. It's gonna be something else. The next time we fight with Quentin and them, and Ian, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna use no real Pokemon. I'm gonna capture all the stupidest level, like super high level bosses. Like I'll throw it like a level 90 Magikarp, 85 Diglett. Like the stu they're gonna not be able to do a thing. But it's gonna be hilarious because they're just gonna be such high levels, but completely useless. I think that's, that's a good idea. I like it. I think, you know what, Mitch, you need to get the thing to a Doug Trio. Level 100. No, I mean, I'm not going to level ASAP. it up. ASAP Ferg. Now, ASAP Ferg, 15 levels? That's not ASAP Ferg. That's ASAP annoying. But you know it's not annoying? I just had a great idea. Stuffing a random there we go. into a ball. I teleported to myself, so now I can, you ready for this, Mitch? Slash kill so I can heal myself, and then just slash back. Wow, look at that one right there. Look at that one. Wow. That was a good idea. Slash back works? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Nice. I just captured one Growlithe. 
And I just captured a Cadabra. And I just captured... Where is it? Wait for it. Wait for it. Wow, really? I didn't get the second Growlithe? Wow. I got the higher level Growlithe. Oh. Level 18 Cadabra, but not the third Growlithe. Jeez. I stand corrected, Mitch. Slash back doesn't exist. And I'm drowning. Yeah, I thought so. Oh, I just found another Bulbasaur. Let's see if I can catch this Jag. Hey, buddy. Hey. Where are you at? I'm about to capture a Bulbasaur in one throw. Oh, wait. I'm glad I missed because I only have two of these balls. I should probably damage him a little. Are you going to... Don't do this. Don't do what? You don't have to do this, Jerome. Hey, Bulbasaur. Jerome. Want to get a Pokeball of mine? Let's throw, I'll throw a Netball on you. How about that? Jerome, are you fighting it? No, I'm just throwing a Netball on it. Why don't you let me burn it a little first? That way we can at least be satisfied to watch him burn. No, no, that's fine. Oh, wow, Bulbasaur. What a shocker. You don't want to stay in the ball. That's right. fine. Let him burn, let him burn. He's earned Mitch? this. He's earned this. Hey, Bulbasaur. Knock, knock. Who's there, Jerome? Hired beam to the face. That's who. No! <sighs> God! Blew that one out of the water. I had him wow. burning. Call up the hospitals real quick. Read the headlines. What does it say right there? Two Bulbasaur sent to the hospital. Both fell down the nasty case of hired beam to the face syndrome. By the way, Unknown. I think I just found a glitch. Unknown cause, but the cause is probably... From a guy who's a major power mover. That's our best estimates, really. Jerome. What were you saying, Mitch? Honest, honest, honest side note. I think I yeah. just found a glitch. So if we ever find another rare, like Mewtwo or something, yeah. I think I know how to cheat. Okay. I get two of them. Oh. Uh -huh. While you were fighting that, I could not damage the Bulbasaur until you tried to put him in a ball and he got out. Then he got out and my fire was killing it. And I think I could have back tried to throw a Pokeball at it, too. So... What I do is I burn it. Like, you try and throw, like, a, if we find, like, an Articuno or something, right? Okay. You, you throw a random Pokeball at it. It's obviously not going to get caught. Then you let me burn it till it's, it's in red health. Then I try and bag it. And if it lets me bag it, it'll you'll still be in a battle with an Articuno that might not exist. Then you throw your Master Ball, and then we both got one. Wow, we could do that. Or I could throw one ball, doesn't get in the ball. Knock, knock, who's there, Jerome? Hype Beam to the face. Boom, that's who. Legendary down for the count. Anyway, guys, I'm going to thank you all for watching. <laughs> Hope you all enjoyed that one. Mitch, that power idea completely shut down in a heartbeat. That so thank you guys. That cool. I had a good idea. Did you just do that? Oh, no, you had a very good idea. But, I mean, I had a better one. So thank you all for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to check out the rest of these Pixelmon videos. And be sure to leave a like. Me and Mitch are always going to be here. Always going to be power moving. And we're always ready for you guys to enjoy our content. That's absolutely right. And I'm so glad we got those two Eevees. Makes me feel all warm and fuzzy. It's too bad we didn't get those Thunderstone shards. But we'll get them next time. So thanks a lot for watching. We'll see you all later. Slap that like button with your forehead. And good night. Bye. Yeah!